we are still in Great Barrington. We are walking to the grocery store. Uh, when I reserved our hotel, I asked the girl at the front desk if there was a grocery store nearby. And she said, yeah, there's one right next door. That's not true. It was a CVS, like a CVS pharmacy. There was no grocery stores nearby. So we're making our way back to the trail and walking a mile to the grocery store to pick up some stuff for resupply. I think we're resupplying for like three days. And then we hopefully will find a hitch back to trail um, soon after that. I think our next stop will be Dalton, Massachusetts, where we'll just stop in to resupply. And I think there's a community center that allows hikers to shower and uh, charge electronics. So that's what's going on right now. It's really noisy. We're on like the walking on the busy street of the town. So. But yep, on the way to the grocery store. If you stay at the Days Inn in Great Barrington, it was a, it was a nice hotel. Uh, just know that there is not a grocery store nearby. You're better just, uh, I don't know, doing what we're doing and walking to it before you hit trail in the morning. All right, we're back on the trail. Back on trail, man. Hitching. It was not too bad. It was a little it was a little tough, but a nice lady finally pulled over for us, so thank you for stopping. Um we Oh yeah, so I tried to upload videos in Great Barrington and our hotel had really bad Wi-Fi. So I only got two videos uploaded and that's because we had to go to a Dunkin' Donuts, which their Wi-Fi was horrible too. Basically everywhere we went, the Wi-Fi was not good. So I hope this doesn't put us behind on uh, getting videos posted, but we'll see. Doing the best that I can out here getting the videos out as best as I can. This is Benedict Pond. It's so pretty. I'm not sure if we can camp here. There's like designated camping spots. But if we can, it would be cool. Alright, so we decided not to stay at that lake because it was like a $10 tenting fee. And I think you had to walk like along another trail to get there to the campground. And we weren't really sure how to get there, to be honest. So we just said, forget it. And we went, we're going uh, 1.3 more miles to the 
Mount Wilcox shelter. So we've got about a half a mile left. So we will be there shortly and eat some food because I'm hungry and get a good night's sleep. So that was today.